What's up, everybody? Happy Sunday. Good morning. Whatever you want to say. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm a minute late to the stream. I apologize. Uh, a little wrapped up doing other things. You know, mostly, uh, I don't know. <laughs> no. Watching anime. Chilling out. I'm still getting everything up to snuff. We are good. Pet Plumbus. Good cat, Plumbus. Pet my wife. I don't like pizza. That's all right. I guess. Nothing special. Honey, please don't talk like that. We're supposed to be in love. But, winter! Yeah, she's looking for pens. Grab everything we can. I'm just gonna kind of just kind of bop through here and grab a little bit of everything. Can I make orchid mead? Well, that's gotta be expensive. I'll make a. I will make an aged barley beer as well. Um. Yeah, we're back. More coral island. Um, we are getting pretty close to the end, I would say, of our Coral Island run here, guys. Um, I don't mean that in a, any sort of negative type of way. We are just, uh, been thinking about it. We are just, uh, reaching kind of a natural send-off for... Coral Island, and we'll be there, uh, sadly a little bit sooner than, uh, you know, I think, I think our natural end point, uh, currently is, uh, the end, well, I wouldn't say the end, but the, um, more than likely the, uh, what is it, the tree planting festival, I want to see the, uh, kind of what happens when we do the third, third year of the tree planting festival um i think i think that's gonna be our our final coral island stream uh once we get there we've done like 20 something parts of coral island and uh you know unless unless something major 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 happens then uh you know we could we could continue further but i'm thinking I'm thinking that's our our send off point for the series. Otherwise, I'm thinking I'm just going to do some off screen work um, until I can get the town to a high enough rank uh, to be able to show you guys new new stuff. And we can have all the like cool new stuff to play with. As I said, we're gonna we're we're gonna finish the ocean today. That's the we're gonna heal the heal all the coral sites. And we're gonna finish that up today, um, without a doubt. I mean, we're right there, uh, so we should be able to finish that up. Uh, excuse me, that was not particularly delicious, by the way. Barley. Alright, let's go drop all this stuff off. Um, trying to make heads or tails out of my uh, inventory here for a moment. Still don't know what to do with cocoa beans. I don't know how to process cocoa beans yet. Um, or what the... What to do with them. So, um, let's get down there and get moving. Oh, I can go pick up... I think I can go pick my watering can up. I think that's finally been upgraded to gold. What do you mean by keg? I have kegs everywhere. Oh, that's right. They're freaking closed today, aren't they? Which doesn't make any sense that I can go in. Um, no, I don't think so. 
Um, I mean, I can't, I can't check because they're all filled and these are all filled. So, um, you can't, you can't mill it, and the oil press doesn't work. It doesn't go in the dehydrator, and I can't put it in those. So, we'll check one of the kegs once it's empty. We'll let one of them empty out so we can see if we can do anything with it. Diving. I'm hoping this only takes us like a day or two in game. Is it cool? Oh, it's a jellyfish. I caught a bunch of those. Um, where am I? Alright, so we just finished up this coral site. That's what I'm thinking. Maybe it's a cooking ingredient. We'll have to see. So I guess we just go south here? I don't think so. I think I have to go. Yeah, I gotta wrap all the way around. I'm gonna grab this uh, red sea here, Chinyo. Um, Alright, yeah, so we're just gonna go up and around here. We don't have that much left to do in the ocean. We should be done. It's a cool looking seahorse. Have I caught one of you before? Yeah, it's a Shio. I've caught one of those before. It's a cool looking seahorse. Okay, so I gotta go this way. I'm just gonna ignore all this. Chase this. Yo, get! Follow the kelp real quick. I'd say all the kelp, like there's really all that much. Chase the roots back a little bit more. Okay. Um, I feel like if I don't clean this area out, I feel like this area is going to become a bit of a hassle. Because I feel like one of the, this one in particular is probably going to come all the way up and around over here. Um, I guess I'll find out here in a second. Let's get the hell out of my way. Also, just not partial to leaving this much trash laying around because it looks like shit. All right, makes me feel a little bit better. Let's just clear my way to the site, I guess. Right, I guess I'll just start uh, this way, looking for the. The beacons. Bacons. Oh, there it is. Coal hog. Which one is it going to act at the right one? That's unfortunate. That's not the one I was hoping it was going to act with. Let's see where you go and what you do. That's not surprising. That's what it is. Oh, we're on, super, we're on weird shit this time. Can you stop hitting like the only- oh my god. Why are you like this? My inventory is full already. That's- every time I dive, dude. You just get so much of the most unnecessary crap down here. Yes. Are you screaming at me already, Fitz? We just started. Why am I allowed no peace in my own home? I 
chest is all the way over here. How odd. Bray. Why? Hmm, fascinating. I didn't find the other one over here and all the clearing I've done, so that's interesting. I was about to say, if it hits this one little patch of trash right here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna scream. I'm gonna cream. Does it free the octopus dude over here? It does. Hello, friend. Are you also just gonna give me crap? Inventory's full again. Get rid of these stones, bro. Oka, you received osmium calcium essence from. Yeah. Oh, you give me the essence. Oh, that's pretty cool. Thanks, dude. So I was correct in assuming that the other beacon was going to come up this direction. I was correct. This game does follow very sort of common patterns. It's pretty easy to kind of figure out once you've been down in the ocean enough. Stamina, whatever will I do? He does Jamu. Get back to it. Oh, I want them fossils, so I'm gonna make more inventory space. Uh, you know what? Trash. I don't need more trash. I got tons of trash. I can get rid of to make room for trash, I guess. Yeah. No, I, don't, I don't need it. I can sit down here. Yeah, I can sit down here. Goodness gracious, dude. I mean, on the plus side, by the time I find it, it's just going to have pretty much a free run, dude. Oh my god, seriously? What? The last pile of trash? Dude, I don't got to do nothing. I'm just going to sit here basically and sip coffee. Then I just gotta kind of hit here. There's probably two down here, and then those two, and then I'm done. I've done it all. You know what I mean? Shit, I'm cool with. If I can come down here and get a pair of sights, pair of coral sights done each day, we should be done with this in like just a couple of in-game days. Which doesn't leave me much left to do in winter. Uh, realistically, but it's okay. Other than just the regular stuff, I just run around and farming and doing all that. And whatnot. Cool. I'll head 
over here and down, so that way we can uh, position ourselves uh, for the next uh, next dive. Come on, yeah. Which uh, oh, I went this way. I just shoehorn myself into this corner. Um, does this little... Alright, yeah, so I got two here. There's two down there and two there. Okay. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna swim back here. I'm gonna position myself. And we will be good for the next day. As I said, this is, this is my number one thing I want to get done. This is also the easiest way to advance your town rank. Um, easiest and fastest. So, we are going to uh, focus on that. What I'm also curious about is hitting the Tree Planting Festival Year 3. I'm curious as to what that does for you. Um, I'm hoping it... Uh, have I sold some of these things before? I haven't sold one of you. I haven't sold one of you. One of you. I'll sell that stuff. I don't care. Doesn't uh, whether I dehydrate it or I sell it as is, it doesn't matter to me. Not really. Um, we are filling up. Okay, it's always nice and clear. Um, we'll grab grab all that. We'll just let that clear up for the morning. It'll be okay. It's literally just. Osmium cranberry jam, which is not really worth anything. No diving level nine, or Texanator level three. Um, catching a uh, seahorse for five hundred dollars. This stuff's not really worth like anything, so you throw it through the dehydrator. Ranching's good. Farming's good. Um, I just want to see aged bar a silver aged barley beer is worth eleven hundred. That's crazy. That aged sake. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap! That's nuts, dude. It's worth so much money. Hello, my pregnant wife. I still can't believe we're officially married. It feels like a dream come true. I'm a wife. Columbus. Crazy, bro. I feel like I need to decorate up here. I might buy some, like, house plants or some shit. Decorate the house a little bit more, too. House is feeling a little plain Jane at the moment, and I feel like we can, uh, we can fix that. Can I make, ooh, lemon jam? Grab all those. None of that can be turned into flowers. And I got a while before anything here does anything. Um, oh, shit. I, uh, that tree's grown. Can I put a tap on that? Um, I do have an extra tap laying around. Oh, whatever this tree is, I cannot put a tap on it. Interesting. Okay. Oh. Are you going to be done here in a second, too? Um, Alright. Do tarot root. Put a couple of barley. That's my pumpkin. I'll let the tarot root run out because I only got two left, so that's good. We gotta we gotta do some more grass on the farm too. We'll do uh, do a lot of that today. Mister Fitz, how are you? 
Are you a cat? Yes. Okay. I like to double check with him because I never know if he's a skinwalker or not. He's after my riches. So I've been uh, strongly contemplating getting my cat a friend. But I'm like nervous as shit about that because I'm like, do I really want another cat in the house? Like, yeah, it'll it'll give my cat someone to play with and leave me alone. But I also have to go through the hassle of trying to introduce them together, which you don't just, you know, fucking drop a cat into your house and go, ha ha, have fun. I, uh, I cat sat for a friend of mine for a weekend and Fitz hissed under the door at the other cat frequently, so I was like, Okay. <laughs> so I'm not I'm not sure if uh, Fitz is 100% um, ready for that level of you know who just wants its Meow. That's right, buddy. Um, what was I... There was something I wanted to... Check on. Um. I can't remember. Um, I want to go check... Let's go check Lake Temple again. It is snowing. Um, so there is something... A couple of things I wanted to check. I just wanted to refresh my brain here. So, snowdrop... Got those planted. Uh, freshwater fish. Arowana. I need that. Saltwater. We need the yellowfin tuna. And the Asian sheephead. I still haven't caught one of those. Uh, the sheephead, pretty easy. Day insects. I need a tiger beetle. That's spring. Rare fish. I think I can catch the arapaima in this season. We got that one done, which literally gave me kind of the, the warp thing, which is one of the worst things I, they could have given me. It's actually kind of duke um we're growing cotton osmium cotton should be pretty easy and an osmium snowdrop should be really easy so we should get a bunch of that stuff um we'll head back to the farm real quick i want to check the computer um uh let's do insect i don't think there's really anything i need really for this season as i said like i need yeah, so we're just going to go to fish. We're just going to look at fish real quick. Town dock. Um, there's puffer fish. I don't need puffer fish. We caught a lot. See, I can get the yellowfin tuna. But it's only between 4 and 6 o'clock. So you have a very tight window for that. And then beach ocean. We got all those. Garden lane. The sturgeon has to be turned in. To the uh, museum. I can get a shark. Damn, there's a bunch of stuff I can get down to the lighthouse. Uh, about the estuary. We caught the rare one, the green sawfish down there, which is good. I'm just missing the frogfish, which is pretty common. Pond, nothing in pond, of course. Forest ocean. Uh, I can get the Asian sheephead down there. So we might, we might hold off on ocean for the day because it is snowing and there's a bunch of fish. I can go get the arapaima in the forest river. Um, yeah, all right, we're gonna do some fishing. Um, we're gonna switch our switch gears for a single day. When it's snowing or raining is when um, the highest volume of unique fish I'm looking for come out. So I need the arapaima from here. We need the sheephead and the yellowfin tuna are the three I can get my hands on. And it's definitely not the arapaima because I feel like that thing's going to fight a chub.
trash. I'm gonna go for it. Okay, so we're gonna have a fishing day. We'll do a fishing jamboree, as it were. Probably another chub. <laughs> Not really fighting back. Oh, crap. What if I actually go down into the river properly? Fighter. Whatever you are. Arapaima. Alright, we got the Arapaima. Um, I think I saw... Was it Asian Sheephead was down... In the Forest Lake? Is it down over here? Hey, yo, I want that. Give me that. Okay, I guess I'll take the acorn. Down here. Why is there was a good spot to fish? I think this was it. Yeah. So I need a sheep head. And then we need to bolt on over to the dock. I said for between four and six. To get our hands on, to try and get our hands on a yellowfin tuna. Oh, polka dot backfish. Uh, the yellowfin, I think it's going to be one of our harder catches. Because it has such a tight window. Fine, I'll just take the trash. Why not? That sheep head. Well, even if I can catch just one of the fish I need, it's still uh, a good, a good, I don't know, good go here, I guess. Stuff stuck in my finger feels great. All right, you're something fun. Holy mackerel. Alright, so I'll do this cast out and then we're going to head over to the docks on the other side of the island. Sheephead? It's probably just another mackerel, I think. Nope. Oh, bad fish. Okay. So we have very limited time to get over to the docks. Hopefully obtain ourselves. Yellow. First thing I catch, I'd be real happy. Oh. There's a yellow tail. That's an yellow I don't know. Jerk. I might need to start, like, working on bait. I think that's something I need to start using more. To try and catch, uh, rarer fish. 
Well, this thing's clearly not going to be what I'm looking for. <laughs> Considering pretty much yeah, it's a pink snapper. Considering that pretty much gave up on the hook. Just kind of lackadaisically just to uh, cruise it in. Dang, that's like a long time for something to show up. It's another pink snapper. You almost don't even need to try to catch those. They just kind of jump on your hook. All right, well, it's... Yeah, we'll, we'll cast out again. Do a couple more casts here, and then we'll probably switch locations. The elephant tuna is the one thing I'm... I really want from this area. These peats. Another yellow tail, dude. Come on, so close. You are not a yellow fin, you're a yellow tail. Someone argues that the, the you know, fins and tail. Shush. Shush. Come on. <laughs> once more, once more, with feeling. We'll probably head over to the lighthouse for a little bit. Looks like there's a lot of stuff down there I haven't caught yet. That's that pink snapper. That's the uh, the one thing about this game, because of course, like you need to like catch stuff and you need to do all that. Your chances of catching certain things is, like, super low by yourself. Um, like, I've got the gold fishing pole. I've got, you know, I, I need to start using bait. I think that's just the one thing that's messing me up is me not using bait to try and catch, uh, catch fish with. Because I think that increases your chances of uh, getting the rare rare fish but then there's times where i've used bait and i've cast out 10 times and have only caught one you know not even one like what i would consider a rare fish like an uncommon a box fish and if i get some stuff for the museum that's cool too but i'm mostly looking for the fish i need uh for the temple fish because I feel like like there's the community center for Stardew Valley which I feel like is um, it's challenging but can be done you know relatively smoothly if you know just kind of how stuff works but because of just how like the fishing and the bug catching works in this one it makes it so hard it makes it so difficult just like in Stardew, you just have fishing. And in this, you also have bug catching, so you have another layer on top. Holy shit. Interesting. Are you a shark? Is this one of the sharks? This would be the hammerhead, right? Interesting. It has like... It has like a fight period. A short break, and then it'll cut right into another, like, fight period. Yep, hammerhead! And I wish in the museum there was, like, some sort of rarity system that would help you, uh, determine, uh, what, like, if some, the rarer an item it is, I wish it would give you, like, more points towards your town rank, which would be cool. 
What's this one? Uh, I got my Arapaima. I can't believe a shark is not on the list of things to put in here. I think that's insanity. Didn't get the sheep head or the yellow fin. Um, yeah, again, we need the gator gar and the giant sea bass, which I don't think are in season. I don't think the arowana, I thought the silver arowana was uh, a winter season fish, and I might be, that's not the place I wanted to go, honestly, I want to go to the museum. Um, so I may be wrong with that, which I'd also not be surprised. Because I keep checking the, the fish scanner thingy, and it's nothing showing up. Send one of those guys, put the hammerhead in there. And everything else can just be sold. So, I mean, we uh, were able to get one of the shrine fish there, which I guess is pretty good. Couple for the museum, which is never. Um, Never bad, you know what I mean? Right, let's go throw some more of this into the... That, and then I guess... We'll do that, just so we can have, uh, I don't, I don't want those not running. We'll try cook, we'll try doing some with the, the freaking cocoa beans. I'll just bring up the wiki and take a look. Um, okay. They, none of these are all pretty common fish, so none of them are really worth anything. Um, okay. Yeah, that Reflessia black honey. Four grand, basically. 3,700. Nice. Or, be honest with me, have you ever seen anything weird on our farm? I don't know, maybe a large mass fear? Why? What did you see? Oh, no, we're not going to talk about that on. So it's snowing again. I don't think I'm going to... Um, I don't think I have anything to use for... Any recipes for chocolate at the moment. Um... We're going to look up chocolate real quick, because I don't want to... Hold up, where is the Coral Island wiggy? Um, items, let's see, mechanics. Oh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, world, no. Uh, where's just crops? I'm just looking for crops. There it is. Crops. Um, the Harvest Festival. Caravan. Okay. Where is Coco? Sam's General Store. Yes, that's where I bought it. I know. Cactus, cranberry. Oh, uh, where you at? What the hell? No. Am I nuts here? I don't see any of the. Okay. <laughs> that was very um, not helpful, Wiki. Um, cocoa bean. I guess I'll search it. Okay. It, it seems like, uh, Okay, you can make hot cocoa, cookies, and chocolate chip muffins. That's literally it. You can't do anything else with it. Um, 
so that is yeah that's all you can do with it I, mean, I don't really have any of the other stuff here i'm just gonna sell the cocoa then that is what it is uh good for to me right now is sheer mums i'm gonna take this damn thing too i don't want that can stuff finish growing please that stuff's all good hey look Boop. almonds We're gonna head down to the uh, ocean. We're gonna dive again today. As I said, that is my big, my big. I want to get that completed today. That's my big one, because that'll push us, uh, hopefully, pretty damn close to B rank. Um, I see. Yeah, we're over halfway. We've almost got this to C, and we're almost to B rank in the ocean, so... Um... We're... We're cooking right now. We're doing real good. Um... Oh, I would also like to go... I'm gonna go get my watering can back today, too. We'll go do that. And, uh, I'll take all my coffers and fossils and stuff like that. We'll go do... Um... All that stuff today, too. We'll get that all... Um... Take care. Dang. Two quail eggs, dude. A little blighter was busy. So, I can start making sake now. Very good. Oh, we're out of barley. And you're still processing pumpkin juice, so. Oh. As I said, I'll be, we're gonna be out of uh, stuff here rather, rather quickly. Whoopsie doodles. I'm just gonna sell this large egg because I don't necessarily care. Oh, I, just, I haven't sold just regular almond. There you go. Um, I will turn the other almonds into almond flour, though. It's worth more to me that way. Okay, so. I said, let's take that, 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 that. I don't really. Do I have any other fossils? No. That's all I got. Okay. This stuff in and we have a pretty empty inventory so we should be able to <laughs> um uh let's see retrieve tool that's gold cool yeah we're always busy over there my good man bead necklace gemstone beads Underwater tablet, silver, glass bowl, glass star, trash, moonlit earrings, glass bowl again, glass bowl again, more moonlit earrings, a silver fork, silver kelp, silver kelp, town model, moonlight earrings, scrap, moonlight earrings, rusty anchor, okay. You know, I'm getting these pirate coffers are only available, you know, kind of in the deep section. I'm really surprised that, like, I'm getting silver kelp out of them. It's actually really disappointing, if I'm to be honest with you guys. Stegosaurus tail, silver kelp, Gallimimus spine. Mammoth spine and a velociraptor claw. 
Hopefully, at least one of those is um, donatable. I said the museum is almost, we're almost to C rank in the museum, so I would like to like to get that up there. One, two, three, four items. Nice. Looks like uh, 250 is our next reward. Let's just double check. That put us over to C rank. So, very good. Very, 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 very good. Alright. Um. I'm going to pop back to the farm real quick. I'm going to offload all this other junk I don't need anymore. And by offload, I mean I am literally just going to sell it. You can literally have it, dude. I don't want it. That being said, I just took away my inventory. We are getting... We're getting mighty low on everything. Not surprising. I mean, we haven't gotten any crops back, and we're in the middle of winter just processing everything we have. Take a drink of water. Ugh! Kind of go one direction for now. Dude, we're making making solid progress already. You know what I mean. And this is gonna be huge. Like finishing this is gonna be massive. Yeah. I mean, it does seem like another like plot point is getting ready to creep up with the whole, you know. for fish trying to they want to implement Karen as mayor um, which you know is a fascinating uh, development as it were Really? How do you oh, stupid controller? Shifted my direction on me without even. <laughs> As I said, uh, the controller I'm currently using is uh, she kind of a an old girl. And I, it's been pretty severely beaten up. I'll just finish out this patch and I'll head over there and go see what kind of nightmare we gotta deal with. Um, this this controller is near the end of its lifespan. Oh boy, I got a lot of work to do. Alright, 
I feel like they just kind of coasted over everything else over here and sort of just ignored a bunch of stuff that was actually in its way, but I'm not going to complain. Of course. Of course. Of course you just run into, like, the only trash that's sitting around here. Unless it does something real crazy, there's no trash for it to run into over here, so... I've pretty much cleared everything. Now I'm gonna double check that it doesn't hit one damn piece of trash. No, it's good. How much does light do its thing? Hear it, it's done. Come down through here, finish all this up. Yet again, I just. I know some of you think I'm crazy for spending all this time clearing all this trash, but all the coffers I get is great for my museum. I wish there was like the mine. It's like you got all like the geodes and the stuff like that you need for like gems and stuff, but it's like it's so the drop rate is so abysmal. is here in a second. More than likely this direction that I'm already about to have cleared out so I don't even need to worry about you. There we go. So that's nothing to get stuck on now. It's just gonna just gonna ride out here. Which is cool because I think we're gonna end up going down here. For me, it works for me. Cause that's we cleared these two super easy, super fast. So, and then we'll head down here. We can start working on the next side, which is good. Yeah, there you go. Get out of my way. Thank you. Are here, anyways. You can go. Bye. Just commence to jiggling as I'm so want to do. If we can get one of these, it'd be kind of cool. It'd be kind of cool. Trash up. Oh, 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 it's a trickster. Pretty far without making 
contact with anything. Double back on itself, it is. Just to just to drive me nuts thinking that maybe it was gonna be clear. Alright. Done. Got a little bit more time, so I'm gonna kinda risk it for the biscuit here. Just kinda keep going for a little bit. Dive. We made so much progress. Three coral sites in one run, especially in this deeper section, is nuts. Get. Yeah, I can't say. Some bitch. Detected. We're almost out of time, too. It's fine. I'm just making progress and I don't want to stop. Okay, yeah, we'll back up. So that's three coral sites healed. That's absolutely schmanging. I love it. guys off. It'll be worth more there anyways. Go. Um, that can go. And then the rest of this can just be tucked away. Should actually be seeing crops tomorrow. That's a rare achievement. You name it, we sell it. Oh shit! Ship all crops. How that? Where? Huh? Hey guys, I think the game just gave me an achievement I wasn't supposed to have. That doesn't make any sense. I don't. Ah. I'm not talking too much, am I? Aren't I? I'm really not usually like this. I think I'm comfortable talking to you. <laughs> I didn't realize how much I'd love being married. I think it's because I married my best friend. Oh, Joel Plumbus, how you doing, bud? Yeah, so I think the game just gave me an, uh, uh, an achievement here, guys. Uh, an achievement I was not supposed to have. So, we have a uh, tremendous amount of cotton. We're going to sell like that. Now, if I believe so. I think I can process cotton into something uh, quite, quite good, actually. I'll take that, I'll take that, I'll take that. Thank you. Um. Ah! Because, of course, processed cotton is going to be worth a lot more than 
I'm gonna process cotton. Yep, I can make cotton cloth. Which I will make another loom actually here in just a second to handle that uh, processing that's not down here. Um, I also need to fill my hay. Nice, very nice. Thank you for the milk. As I've also said too, I'm not keen on going for all of the achievements in this game. Just because like 100% in this game sounds like a... I'll, I'll, I'll think about 100% in the game and co-ops in the game. Because you split the um, responsibility among multiple people and it just sounds like it's going to make life a lot easier. Versus um, doing it all yourself, which is difficult. I imagine the, um, this game in co-op is going to be, like, some of the, like, kind of where I'm at right now, like, upgrading the town rank, doing all that stuff, I feel like would be a lot smoother than doing it by yourself, because, of course, you know, like, I have to, um, all the responsibility is mine right now, whereas if you have multiple people, you can very easily, um, disperse workload and just make the game, um, a touch touch smoother um while i'm also thinking about it we need uh we need more cotton seeds so what is it 70 it's 48 yeah 72 it's 72 um i imagine cotton is gonna be a pretty baller crop Like, I believe if I was to probably sell it, I'd probably make, um, like, all of it, I'd probably make a huge profit. But as I said, we're going to make another, we're going to make a loom to uh, accommodate for all that. Cow beans. I'm just gonna sell those. Um, I think I needed to donate cotton to the temple. Me tinks. Me tinks. That's something I needed to do. Wasn't in there. Wasn't in there. Wasn't in there. That's uh, one of my rare crops. Bam. So that's good. Got one of those. Um, we'll head back to the farm real quick. So, uh, I'm going to make a couple of... Gold bars! <sighs> you motherfucker. <laughs> um, that sucks, dude. I need three gold bars, which I think I can make three gold bars, so I can make an additional loom, so I can process, um, yeah, there we go, oh, these are full, I'm gonna sell a bunch of batteries, because I can, alright, so we won't be getting our additional loom today, but that's fine. I can also always go and buy gold, uh, gold ore from the blacksmith. So that's, that can be done. That can be on the dock at any time I wish it. Um, pull up, let me, 
right, we're gonna we gotta reorg reshmorgmize here because this is uh, not bueno inventory management, honestly. Um, cool. Um, that's great. Well, because we can't really, we gotta wait for that gold. Uh, we're just gonna head back to the diving pier, and we're gonna continue doing that. It will be magnificent. Cool. So, with that, I'm gonna go use the restroom. I will be right back. I'm relieved. You, Mr. Starfish, yoink. Red knob starfish. Red and spikies. It eats almost anything that's small enough. Starfish are actually crazy. What a, what a cool animal, though. It's like... The ocean and pretty much most of the stuff in the ocean, I, I'm not a fan of. If you put me in the ocean like an octopus like clung to me, I'd probably like just perish. Um, I think octopus are cool, but you can also don't touch me. <laughs> um, but like, man, the ocean is full of aliens, bro. They gotta be aliens. If that shit don't make sense. We need to stop. Stop messing with stuff. <laughs> Leave it there. Put that thing back where it came from or so help me. Dang, this area is huge. Is that a gooey duck? It's not Geo Duck, I can tell you that much. Very wrong pronunciation. Oh good, those there was also roots that were didn't want to leave that were blocking my screen, so I'm glad those are gone.
pretty hype, by the way. There's a. I got some 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 great content planned coming up here soon for everybody. Just uh. Just excited, man. Just excited. I got uh. I got. Kind of the the game for after uh, Greedfall. I've already got that figured out. That's exciting. So I, like today, I almost played Greedfall. I was like, I want to finish it. And uh, but Sunday, Sunday is cozy day. We play cozy games on Sunday. So I need to maintain that. You know, I'm excited for excited for everything. I get too excited sometimes. And, Finally. That should be done. If there's anything left in this area that needs to be hit, I'm going to be real surprised. Yep, and then we pop through there, and we go over here. We should hopefully, maybe, have enough time to finish this next one. Yep, yep, you just do your thing, spin around in circles, and... Oh, so exciting. Oh. Sick. Final zone. We're into the last area. Already found one. That is a good, good sign. Except for the fact that I have to get all the way over there now. Go get it. No, it's blocked. You annoying turd. Game's, uh, game's lagging a little bit right now. You're lagging a little bit, dude. if it was going to go down or not, but I was wrong. You cannot predict where these ones go. They were, they were pretty easy to predict on, like, the first couple of uh, depths, but now that we're, I'm into, like, the deep, deep, like, it, it just kind of does whatever the hell it's going to do. That other one wants to pop up. That'd be also really cool. Why not be able to get this one finished? 
One more dive, I'm thinking. Looks like it, like... The model for that jellyfish is, like, totally, like, tweaked out. It's hilarious. Oh, no, there it is. Pass, man, and I don't know where to go. What the hell? going next until it gets back around to that area so let's just keep chopping trash up until uh all right it's done also i'd like to go in here and make some space because that is a fossil i can make glass i can't make fossils All the sick coral. Oh, I did it. Tremor who felt. Could it be? Hmm. Hmm. Unbelievable. The coral tree. It's healed. It's a miracle. To think that land dweller did this. I knew Lee could do it. This is incredible. It's more beautiful than I remember. The people of our kingdom haven't seen this invigorated for a long time. Have been this invigorated. Choyo, despite our current respite, I can still sense lingering roots in the lands above. We must seek guidance from the goddess on how to proceed. Yes, your majesty. Let's hope the goddess is as pleased as we are and can offer us guidance. Shed back to the castle. There's an important matter concerning Lee that we need to discuss. Yes, my queen. You read my mind. <laughs> so, it's telling me I need to head back to the castle. Um, which we will do... We have more time. So, well, <laughs> we gotta head back up. We gotta go schnooze. And then we'll be back to the... Um, Back to the ocean to go talk to the merfolk. That way, that's right, my inventory is full, full. I sell you. And you. And the gooey ducks. And that, and that, and that. The rest of this can be stash -aroonied. Do I have? Oh, I have a. F we'll just 
take that out. I don't need a fourth thing of trash, honestly. Run out of flowers, man. I wonder if any of that cotton's it's done. No, one done. Hey, oh, that's done. That's good. That's. Just said we're gonna make another loom here. Yeah, that seems like a as good place as any. Just a bronze cotton cloth. That should be hopefully worth a bit of money. We'll see what the difference is between a bronze selling bronze cotton and then a bronze cotton cloth. Plumbus, my relationship went up, yeah. Eighteen hundred dollars for all those batteries. Dude. Starfish, thirty six hundred for all those sturgeon. Yeah, nothing really much for diving, ranching, that's all pretty good. Alright. So cotton by itself is actually a pretty decent crop. Um, I mean, $139 for a bronze, $241 for osmium. It's all pretty good. Uh, almond flour always sells pretty good. So $139. All right. Yeah. It's about, uh, as per typical, just about doubles it. Fairy rose honey, dude. It's worth so much. It's so good. Um, yeah. No, this, this rocks, dude. We are we are still making really good money through winter despite um you know not doing much. Hi honey, I healed the ocean, honey. You get the best gift. I don't need anything. Well, I'm gonna give you something because you're my wife and always appreciate your wife. So it's the eleventh. Her she's on the twenty seventh. It'll be good. It'll be good. So this is probably from the. Uh, and recognize your service to our kingdom, King Krakatoa and Queen uh, Nanda Devi. Extend an invitation for you to visit Naga Castle. We look forward to welcoming welcoming you at the castle. Visit the Naga Palace. I know. I'm the I'm the bomb.com, bro. Y'all y'all ain't gotta stress it. Y'all ain't gotta worry about it. I know. I know how cool I am. You know what I'm saying? I know how cool I am. Y'all ain't gotta tell me. So we'll take care of the animals and we're gonna head down to the Naga Palace. And we're going to go uh handle that. I keep forgetting to refill the hay. I wanna fill up the silo and not have to worry about it. Um I've also because I filled up the uh my one loom. I don't have anywhere to process uh, process the uh, sheep's wool, so that is just probably gonna get sold because it'll it's not gonna not gonna hurt me if I just sell the sheep's wool. I don't money right now is not even I'm, I'm not concerned about money at all. Like money doesn't concern me right now. I have I have all of like the biggest upgrades I can get my hands on right now, so it's not even um not even a thing. I'm so so unconcerned about cash. So Alright, let's go get these eggs moving and then I will go and uh I'm gonna grab my hay out and refill the silo. Just go over here and grab this pumpkin juice. That's the last honey I had for that. <laughs> I don't have any more flowers, so um, we might be. Um, I I sold too many of my flowers, uh, unfortunately. Like a. Uh, like a dingus, and uh, no, we, we just 
just don't have them. Um, I don't really have them to refill, and flowers don't really come back during the winter, so. Um, oh, shit, we got harvest. That's tea leaves. Which I'm sure I can turn into actual tea. Them snowdrops got forever. Um, I only did three of cotton? That's fine. So I have four of the tea leaves. I have an insane amount of tea leaves right now, dude. Holy shit. Sell those regulars. Sell that. Sell that. Um, I mean, the tea leaves are... We can process them. Um, online shop. Tea leaves take 11 days. Ugh. Let's take 12 days. Can also grow those in spring as well, which I find really interesting. Uh, I mean, we can, we can, we have enough time for another uh, crop of tea leaves. So these, I need 72. I do. I have four plots for these. So it's 72. Is that right? Yeah, that seems right. It's the shipping bin dummy. I mean, if I decided to, I could just sell off all of my tea leaves because one, the the spot I have to turn them into, I might just keep my osmium ones because I'm like. Um, well, maybe, I don't know, we'll see. I got, currently, all of my, like, kegs are being, uh, occupied by other stuff. I've got a lot of sake being made, and I got the pumpkin juice, which, I mean, I could just rotate them with the pumpkin juice and be fine. Just refresh the one sake. Um, and that's like, I think that's the only thing I can really do with it is turn it into tea. Ooh, are you gonna do that thing again game where you don't wanna actually tick over and give me stuff? Because I might be willing to, um, all right, so I can't just like, Uproot the machine while it's working, which I was kind of hoping I could, like, interrupt the machine and then get stuff. So, um, let's readjust my inventory here. You guys know as well as anybody that I do not like having a, a dirty inventory. It drives me mad. I mean, I've got... I think I might I might keep the the gold and osmium ones because I have like a ridiculous amount of them and I might sell off the silver and the bronze ones because I just I just don't think I need that much. All right, let's go to the Naga Palace. Also, just curious. Um, yeah, fruits above. We got the Naga Palace. Let's see if that brought us so close. That was a hundred points for all corals healed plus 10 for each one I did like that's like that brought ocean almost up to a rank like as I said the fastest literally the fastest way to level up your town is just the steamroll uh the coral coral sites Look at me 
me being respectful. Welcome, Lee. Today we bear witness to an exceptional resolve. As your strength of character that saw past initial doubts per persevered. We confess that when you arrived, our hearts were filled with uncertainty. Yet, you did not allow our hesitation to deter you. You healed our coral tree, restored vitality to our kingdom. Your actions spoke louder than any reassurances. Ooh. Today we honor your unwavering spirit and bravery. We present to you the seal of Naga, the highest honor in our kingdom. The seal symbolizes trust and friendship. It represents your freedom to enter and leave our kingdom at will as a cherished friend of our people. With the seal, we also pass on our heartfelt gratitude and respect. You were once a stranger, now a friend. Our kingdom will always remember your heroic efforts. As for our final order of business today, we have been tasked by the goddess to summon the spirit of the coral tree. This will rid the lands above of lingering roots. To summon the spirit, one must blow the golden conch. We all agree that the honor of doing so shall be bestowed upon you, Lee. When you are prepared, please visit the coral tree under the cover of night to evade prying eyes. The oracle will guide you further. Okay. Okay. See you on friendship with the Merfolk Kingdom. Wait until nighttime. Visit the coral tree. Like. I wish I could tell my wife. I wish I could be like, honey. Honey. I saved the Mer Kingdom. That's nice, sweetie. Respect. Big tree. Please don't ever die. <laughs> so that's the coral tree. So I'm supposed to visit the coral tree under the cover of night. Whoops. All the wrong buttons. Wait until night time. Well, I can't just like wait, bro. And night is at six o'clock. <laughs> I guess we're just kind of putzing around for a minute. I guess we can go. We can go talk to the peoples. The princess is down here. We can go talk to her. Uh, or not? What? Newfound strength flows through our people. You have played a part in this. Thank you. The day you arrived, my precious stamina fruit seemed to vanish. Any simple coincidence? I don't know what you're talking about. Bro, there's all these shops on here. I'm not allowed to enter these. Fruit, crops, special crops. Bro, I want into the general store. What do you mean I'm not allowed to enter, bro? I literally just saved your kingdom. I don't think some of this stuff is properly uh, implemented just yet. Like, I can't even, like, talk to her. I can talk to him. Prepare to be amazed. A whole new area has been opened. No more slimes. What? <laughs> Are you okay, my guy? I guess we'll go talk to the old lady. Oracle Chamber. Taking a deep breath, you instantly wish you hadn't. <laughs> All these. Ignore them, my friend. You and your two legs. Just pay them no mind. Being an oracle is a process that happens within. Deep within my soul, Cho'oyo doesn't require the assistance of worldly items. The trinkets and baubles, they're just here to add a splash of color to the place. As a testament of my gratitude, I offer you my jaw necklace. However, I regretfully confess that my attempts to sell it yielded only two shells and three stripes of wild kelp. It's a pity, really, because it's lovely, yet nobody seems to see its beauty. Sometimes Cho'oyo sees too much. 
Oh, okay. Clearly, um, some of this, the, the Murfol Kingdom's kind of not working fully, um, on Xbox, it would seem. A Gung's house. Denali. Cooking staff house. Barracks. Tattoo shop. Wait. Sam's general store? <laughs> You're not allowed to enter. Okay. Cool. Glad I saved your kingdom and I'm not allowed to enter places. Oh, I can go into the cooking staff house though, but you know, I'm not allowed to buy anything, I guess. Can I loot? No. So like now, now we're really running out of stuff to do in this game. <laughs> really running out of stuff to do. Um, because I mean, Lord knows. So do I have to, is my objective up top? Like, is, am, am I not supposed to be down here? So it says, wait until nighttime, visit the coral tree. Because I thought this was the coral tree. I mean, I guess we're just going to hang out for a minute. Um, there's really nothing to do. <laughs> Except just kind of swim around. Uh, and wait for wait for time to progress. I wish I could make time go faster, but technically we're, we are already at the fastest I can move time for the game. So. I can't even, like, talk to people properly, which is disappointing. That would, that would help kill, kill a bunch of time. But yeah, as I said, we're, we're, and by we're, I mean, I'm, uh, almost to the end of the Coral Island uh, series here on the channel. I just feel like we've, there's, we're, we're running out of stuff to do. At least, at least on stream. Um, because it's, we're, we're mostly to the point of like, I gotta catch bugs, I gotta catch fish, I gotta go mining, I gotta do all this crap. So, greetings, Lee! Before us lies the Golden Conch, an artifact of significant historical and spiritual importance in our kingdom. It's believed to carry the ability to summon the spirit of the Coral Tree. It is no small task that you've been given, and we trust that you'll perform it with the same courage and determination you've shown us so far. Take the Conch, Lee, and blow, it, blow into it for three seconds. No more, no less. Patience, everyone. These are ancient. These are ancient magic in the workings of the goddess. We must trust in their ways. all the roots to retract. <laughs> Hiya, Professor. I feel like there might be more than just a couple of people that would notice this. Just saying. 
I catch a couple of night owls. That's up near the farm. It's complete, roots above. Talk to the. Oh, that just gives me the overview. So that's that's uh, it. I imagine on the next morning there might be another letter. Maybe the professor one will want to talk to me or something like that. Pretty groovy. Oh yeah, it looks like it's refusing to take over. Fantastic. We might have to reload the game, that's fine. Oh, I mean, there's really nothing to do. Um, let's see. Again, tea leaves, also not that bad. Did you see it? All the roots are gone. Any guesses on what might have happened to them? Maybe. The good thing about where is when my birthday is. What else I can do without? What is my relationship with Plumbus? Um, family? Oh, we're maxed out. Or where? Oh, the merfolk. Oh, that's why I can't really talk to any of them. They're all locked, technically. Let's see. Yeah, hold up. We're gonna uh, return to title. We're gonna just reload the reload the day. It is uh it's very exciting. Very, very, very exciting. See how the roots are going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Kudo. Give my wife a gift. All right. Hopefully, yeah, that, that always fixes that. That's good. Keep making that. Rooms are good. Got so much time on everything. Um Okay, well that raises the question of what's the uh the next step here, I guess. Um, I mean, cause I mean, one of the, as I said, I'm not really going for all the achievements. Sounds like an asshole. Uh, in and of itself. Um, I mean, we can work on filling in the farm with grass. I mean, that's not the only... Um, as I said, we're gonna go... We'll probably go talk to everybody. 
um, we'll bump into all the NPCs we can and see what everybody has to say about the, the, the roots being gone. Um, which seems like a pretty big, it's a pretty big milestone. Um, I'm sure all the people of the island are extremely excited about it, so. I'd be too, honestly. Oh cool, those are done. Oh hey, what's this? Lychee. Avocados. And pears. I already had pears. I do. Oh, okay. Oh, we got avocados and lychees now. Which I will sell one of each. Because that'll just add to my um, stuff I've sold. Cool. Alright, sell that. Ooh, that's a, that's a silver cotton cloth. That should be worth a nice chunk of mm, change all. Sake, sake. Um, I might not refill that one sake. I might leave that one so I can let that uh, go out so I can make uh, start making tea in that location. And as I said, I've, I've saved some of this stuff just in case I like run out of inventory to make you know artisan goods with. Um, let's uh, let's head in the town. Oh, whoops. We will go talk to folks. Uh, the professor is the person I'm most interested in going and talking to. Um, she seems like she's going to be the person that has uh, the most interesting stuff to say. If it isn't Raina, why aren't you wearing any winter clothes? No, that's right, because remember, she wants to, uh, Karen wants to become the mayor, so. Looks like she's gathering everybody up. Are you, like, complaining at people? What's going on? Thank you all for being here. Dear Townsfolk, I am announcing my intent to run for mayor of Starlet Town. Municipal Code 7712 allows a challenger with enough signatures to force a mayoral re-election. And yes, Mr. Mayor, I have that document right here. I'll visit every home, gain your trust, and prove that I am the ideal candidate for this role. With me as mayor, this town will be will see unprecedented growth and prosperity. Time to put the star back in Starlet Town. Well, it sucks for you, because um It's not gonna happen. You think these people would vote for you? You'd have to force the whole thing. Once those the once these simple and see what I'm offering them. <laughs> mayor Karen, it's practically a done deal. You know, being a shithead doesn't help you. Hi, hon. What a beautiful day. Why don't we go out and something other? Maybe a picnic at the beach? Uh, it's the middle of winter, hun, but I like your attitude. I like where your head's at. <laughs> Excuse me. I'd like to talk to one of the researchers here. Get out. Excuse me? You haven't even heard what I had to say. I said, get out. But 
I have no interest in talking to you or your kind. My kind? Well, I hope you can continue your research once I'm mayor of this town. Goodbye, then. Mayor. Who does she think she is? So she's just gonna, like, barge in everywhere and, like, try to, like... Talk to folks. Is she even here right now? She's not even in here right now. <laughs> um, so, I mean, yet again, there's up upgrading produce quality. Um, I can buy stuff from her. There's nothing particularly interesting. Um, you can develop more equipment. There's the auto feeder, which I already have. There's the auto petter and auto collector. All this stuff. Um, the foraging component. Um, which I could use and it would tell me what is forageable, which I, I don't need. Automation chest, the ultimate scarecrow, and then there's the auto trash collector. Um, I don't need any of this stuff. I don't, I don't feel any compulsion to want any of that stuff. So, hey, you said she's in there. I didn't see her in here. Now she's in here, okay. Unless I completely missed her. Remembering the announcement again makes my blood boil. Pufferfish is a plague to the lands. I donate the scars and beanies I knit during the year to a shelter on the other side of the island. I hope they can use them. I always try to donate before winter hits. Just whenever... Just whatever I knit that year. Usually the mayor and Bree have things for me too to send. Nice. Okay, well nothing about the... Coral, I guess. Forgot I had these up here. Um, I wonder if I can talk to the giants. If the giants have anything interesting to say. Um, I'm almost wondering if maybe I have to hit the next town rank. Which I mean, I'm so, so close. <laughs> ah, so close. Ah. Then the ocean temple is healed, so that was, was an additional 50 points. I'm still like 100 points off. I'm like, well, I'm like 90 points. Um, which, how do you even get the ocean any higher? <laughs> which I don't think you can. I think, I think A rank is as high as you can take everything right now. Um, yeah, I already did that. Like, I can't. No, Charles wants a tea leaf. I got those. Uh, where, where is Charles? I'll go find him real quick and do that. Um, Charles, select find NPC. Of course, he's not at the clinic. That makes all the sense in the world. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of... Uh... Oh, the, uh, the goddess. Yeah. That's pretty good. It really isn't there. Oh, Luke. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to lose your pen. No worries. It's just a pen. Don't sweat it, alright? That's ex That thing's expensive. Oh, the Oracle? Well, it must be. I mean, how could it not be? Why do you need a gold plated pen anyway? Hmm. Don't worry about it. We have plenty. Hi, Lee. What's up, Gaius? Yeah, that's the Oracle. What's up? Thanks for lending me your pen. Oh, you found my pen! Or, I mean, loose pen. Er. <laughs> it's okay. You can keep it. I'm rich, after all. Really?
Anyway, I should go. If you guys will excuse me. It's nice to see you, Lee. Look, I'm married. You're very handsome. You're very nice and rich. But I'm married. Sorry, buddy. So. Luke's pen? Yeah, I forgot to bring a pen. Luke and I were just hanging out at his place before I came to see you. After that, I promised Charles I'd get everything done by then, so I didn't have time to go home. So I just took his pen. <laughs> well, you saved me. Thanks again for finding this, Lee. Monsieur, I have a tea leaf for you. Thank you. Right, I guess we'll pop down underwater and go talk to the Oracle. So let's uh, fast travel right here. Let's head back to the farm for just this schmeckle. Oh, there we go. End of a chapter it is. From murky depths, a brighter kingdom emerges. Thank you, my friend. The slimes have vanished. All right, she's got nothing for me. Let's. Uh, I'm gonna load up the wiki real quick. We're gonna take a look at the wiki. Um, and see kind of what I might be able to do next. To see what's up. So. Uh, there's the Giant's Quest. Which I think I'm done with the Giant's Quest. Yeah. Uh, ocean. Okay, so it. I'll get this, uh, the quest you're telling me to do is three days after, um, so I'll get that in a, another day or two. Uh, museum's all done. Um, okay. And then there's just all the side quests and stuff like that, so... Um, I mean, currently, we really can't do much else, um, aside of just our regular stuff, which is just trying to, of course, get our town rank up, and we have to go up a hundred freaking points. Which is the museum, and that's, we have like the museum. Um, and then of course we have the various uh, donatable things that we're working on, so I don't, I don't know. I don't know, so I guess we're just going to spend some time. And we're gonna we'll throw some grass down on the farm. <laughs> Just to kill some time. Um, as I said, we're I'm we're getting uh 
pretty close to the end of this series, guys. We're, uh... I just run out of stuff to do. You know what I mean? Like, we're... I'm running out of things to... To do. We, uh... You know what I mean? Like, there's only a finite amount of things to do, which is uh, really sad. And I have to get the town rank up to B, which is just a kind of a nightmare currently. Um, because of just how much stuff needs to be done uh, to do so. And then, like, the thought of going to A rank is, like, actually insanity at the current moment. And then they're, they're adding an S rank later. Which is, like, how on God's green earth? Like, you gotta be adding, like, more quests and stuff and furthering all that. And, it's like, and allegedly, I'm supposed to be having a kid. Like, there's supposed to be a child born at some point. I don't know how long um, a child takes to be born. Um, I don't know, typically it takes, uh, you know, months for a child to be born in reality, but this is Coral Island, so things are going to go differently. Um, oh my god, that was 150, and it didn't even fill in that entire thing? Holy sh shnikes, Batman. I mean, the farm is farming, you know what I mean? We'll have, um, it's just, it's just, it's giving me one of those things. It gets dark, and then we're just basically gonna <laughs> go to bed and then start the next day. Oh my gosh, before I forget, for like the 300th time, let's take the hay out and refill the damn silo. Stupid. Farming. thing I want is for that to run out. Load up one last eggplant. Just kind of grab everything one last time. Cool. And the crops in winter just take so long to grow. Like depressingly long to grow. <laughs> Yeah, we'll have that quest from the Oracle, and then that's... Hey, relationship with Charles one. Farming, was there anything here on the yeah, kimchi? Is funny. Foraging, morels. I need to find a better mushroom to, uh, a higher quality mushroom anyway, to put into the... the log thing. Hi, hon. Nothing else was going to be about Pufferfish leaving the island. Turns out it was a crazier event than a UFO landing here. Let me Suki my brain. do this here. I remember a gift for Suki too. So I got like two weeks. Yeah, because there's the winter fair, which I'm not at all like interested in. It's not gonna really do anything for me. Um, considering I pretty much already um, did everything last year, so it's not like there's going to be any rewards. Oh my gosh, I have something to harvest. Hold on. Let's clear up my inventory here. So I need a regular snowdrop, and then I need an osmium one, which I got. Should be able to get one more harvest of snowdrops too. All right, so as is uh, typical of me, let's sell one of each type just because I want to see what the um... oh, I can make snowdrop honey. You say, and I got a lot of these damn things. 
So, let's head up to the temple. And this is, we're actually going to have the whole thing done. So, hold up, we're going to go over here. I'm going to go to rare crops, I'm going to drop that off. Which, I don't remember, hold on a second. Um, alright, so that doesn't do anything. I don't need more bee houses, dude, I'm fine. And that is the greenhouse complete. We now have greenhouse. She just gives me tea seeds. Yes, I wish to summon the goddess. Okay, never mind. Uh, we have a greenhouse now. Alright, so now all those are clear. Make some lemon, put some pear in there. Um, uh, how do they go? Those in there. Alright, sake has been cleared finally, which is good. Uh, my inventory is such a god awful mess right now. I need to. Oh, I gotta readjust here. Hold up, let's sell everything I don't need. And then we gotta buy some more seeds. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna sell off the silvers. And I'm gonna sell off the golds and the bronze. Um, I'm literally just going to sell those tea seeds because I just don't, under any circumstances, need all those tea seeds. I don't know why I just did my inventory like that. It's going to drive me nuts. I have two spots. I will take these guys and just shove them up there for now. Um, let's buy some um, more of these. It's another 96, I believe. That'll be cool. That'll be cool. So, um, should make us. And we got the greenhouse, which is cool. Not really uh, certain on that right now. We'll check it out here in just a second. And I think on the next day we should get that mission from Choi Oil. That's it, Oracle. Such a messy plant. Again, I should wish I could just hold the X button and plant, but it's okay. I, all right, all right, all right. Cool, it's all planted. Looking real nice. Um, so I take it is the is that just a buildable structure for my um, farm? Is that all that is? Farming is 10, ranching is 9, foraging is 8, 9, 9, 8, 7, and 5. Uh, I mean, with mining like that, I should probably head down and go uh, mine and hit level 10. I could always do that. Oh, they're arguing again. I really don't want to be part of this. Honey, this doesn't have to be such a big deal. I don't want to go alone. 
You're right. It's not a big deal. I think I overreacted a bit. I'm sorry for walking out like that. I just feel like we've been doing so many of these events lately, and I'm getting overwhelmed. This might be a little awkward for me to walk up. Hey, guys. How you doing? Hey, Lee. Sorry you walked in on us like that. We just had a little disagreement. That's all. Honey, if you don't want to go, that's okay. I don't want you to if you don't feel comfortable. But I have to attend. It's one of my alma mater, so I can't skip it. Next time, we'll choose together. Let's only go to the fun ones. Okay. Yeah, I do want to go, because then I get to see some friends. I just don't feel like going to a big gala. I'm not in the mood for fancy dinners and dressing up. What do you think I should do, Lee? Oh. You should do what you want. If you want to see your friends, but don't, uh, but not go to the gala, that's what you should do. Yeah. I might just do that. I'll contact a couple of friends and see if they want to meet. Thank you for the insight, Lee. It's a good thing to work hard and keep going, but I feel it's even better to recognize when to stop and take a break. Well, as long as you decide uh, before next Friday, because I need to make hotel arrangements. I really just came to see if you had any junk laying on the ground I could take. Yoink. Um, yeah, I guess we'll work on that stuff over the next uh, you know, couple of in-game days, I guess. We'll just... Gonna go find scroungeable stuff. Um, oh, honestly, really what I should do is I should go down to the... Um, the hardwood forest now and go just chop down a ton of trees down there probably get my foraging up to 10. Um, I'm thinking that's what I'm gonna do. We'll just go cleave a ton of trees down. Should be walking around with my bug net out. I'm catching bugs too. I can work on getting that up to 10 because my catching is only at 8. Did you get anything going on? Stairway farmer. Cheap hanger rack. Tropical potted plants. Coconut. Kombucha. A praying mantis. Like this tree is still kind of nasty. So, it hasn't healed everything yet. Um, let's go, we'll go this way. Yes. some hardwood I mean not the worst thing in the world because of course giving getting my scavenging to 10 means I will have it'll give me some sort of new uh, crafting uh, schematic and could be something good inventory is full why 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 Ginger, the ginseng is worth more, so. Alright, let's, uh. This is what I'm here for. Just gonna chop down a few of these here trees. Because, uh. 
Lumbering works towards your scavenging. Oddly enough. I mean, I'll build up a stockpile of hardwood too, so that's not really putting me out for that one either. down a few trees we'll uh as I said we're operating on kind of short days right now because there's not much else to do um as i said we're gonna we can work on fishing um and just kind of leveling up some skills I could just like cheese it and go use my merit points to go buy the uh, like the skill point elixirs, essentially. Aside of like leveling up a few tools, there's not much else I have to do. Um, I mean, we can get all the osmium tools. I don't realistically do not see a reason to get all the osmium tools. There does not appear to really be a reason. Um, aside of maybe like the osmium pickaxe, which I'm thinking about going and doing. What's up, bud? You got anything good? Piggy bank, foreign person, it's all the same stuff you always have, so. Alien scarecrow is kind of dope. A plop <laughs> backpack, that's cute. Rich duck glasses, four leaf clover backpack, VIP outfit, heartthrob, <laughs> ultimate BFF. Um, golden chicken outfit for a million dollars, bro. Like, I get the joke, but come on. Back down to the firm. Drop everything off. Uh, materials. 285 hardwood. Um, everything else can pretty much be sold. Truth. Um, we're out of pickle egg plants here. So I'm gonna go there. Um, I'm out of pumpkin juice. We can no longer do pumpkin juice, which that is a blessing. I've been doing pumpkin juice for so damn long. So a gold green tea is worth $205. Let's, uh, let's decorate the house a little bit more, too. We'll do all that stuff. Holy shit. Yeah, snowdrops worth good money. So. I mean, Osmium is worth 287. So I imagine the honey is going to be worth uh, a pretty good, pretty good amount. About 700, maybe. Double or triple. Oh, there's the greenhouse. Good thing the inn is so close to the farm. I don't have to take, uh, I don't have to take too long to walk to work. Yeah, so we're gonna, we're gonna buy some decorations for the house. House is looking a little, a little schmempty. Uh, we always found something interesting. This is fantastic news. Cool. So there's that.
prison where my fruit trees have produced for me. Cocoa beans don't mean much. Uh, some almonds. Shoot. Let's go visit the animals. Did I forget to visit the animals? I hope I didn't. That would suck. Yeah, unfortunately. Fortunately, the pig is not helpful in winter. The pig cannot do anything. Aside be, you know, a pig. I mean, the pig is not a reliable source of income. Just because it's, yeah, it takes so long. Well, the animals don't like going outside during the winter. It's, as I said, like, money doesn't mean anything to me anymore. And I'm not going to go spend a million dollars on a gold chicken suit. So. Aside <laughs> of just buying everything in the game, there's really, uh... You know, I've got all the house upgrades. I got all the fun stuff, so... I think I missed, uh, missed my animals on the previous day. Oopsie poopsie. Um, I think I some water juice, why not? Um, I got... You just literally have all these other eggs. I don't... It doesn't hurt my feelings. I'll just sell them all. Um, cool. Alright, I guess we're gonna go talk to Choi Oyo. Oh, it's, um... Do that. Sell those cocoa beans. Okay. Four gold cho-cho beans. Um, alright, let's go talk to the Oracle. Should give me something to do for a little bit at least. Come over here, Lee. Are you gonna touch me inappropriately? Troy has found something interesting. Very interesting indeed. Before I tell you more, I'd like to ask you one question. How would you feel about getting rid of that soup for good? Uh... Yeah, it's very uncomfortable. I thought so. You may have a solution for this particular dilemma. So I found the scroll the other day while I was strolling through the deep sea. Or rather, the goddess led me to the scroll of the deep sea. It's an interesting diagram. Toyo needs some time to properly look through it. But it seems like a spell to turn a landfolk into a merfolk. So, might this be of interest to you? Maybe? Is it permanent? It shouldn't be. There's only one way to find out. Joyo needs some time to further decipher this, of course, but here's a couple of necessary ingredients we'll need. Uh, that you'll need to collect. This ceremony is for your benefit, after all. Well, what are you waiting for? The currents wait for no one. I'll send you a missive once the spell is ready. Alright, let's see what, uh... One of us. Uh, gather what she needs. Five osmium kelp essence, okay. I was like, huh? Um, I guess we'll go... A 
let's, uh, let's do this the easy way. I'm gonna fast travel over to Limopulu. And that, that should allow me to uh, get over to the Osmium Kelp a little bit easier. I have a bit of Osmium Kelp, but I do not have that much Osmium Kelp. And considering the... Uh, the kind of conversion rate is uh, dreadful for uh, kelp. We are just gonna we're gonna just spend all the rest of our day down here looking for osmium kelp because um, we need like a staggering amount of it. I think I've already got one that was given to me as a gift. Making four more shouldn't be too bad, but having all the extras. Uh, on hand to upgrade my other stuff if I'm so inclined to do so I really should do the fishing pole really should do the fishing pole to help uh, increase your catch percentages I guess reduces your chances of getting trash and stuff like that so I should probably do that they really said, oh, you want this final, you know, high tier material? Well, we're going to make it hard to find. And when you do, we're going to pretty much uh, put not too much of it. Oh, you got ten? That's cool. That's one, one essence. And you're like, shit. Eesh. It's all right. It's all right. So. This is uh, it's okay. Gives me gives me a little bit of something to do. You know what I mean? Like I'm not uh, I'm not complaining. It gives me gives me an objective to keep me busy. So as I said we are. <laughs> We are, we're, I'm just about done with the game. Anyways. It's, um, I, I've, I've hit a point where I'm just like, because I'm running out of things to do, um, I'm getting just a little bored with it, you know what I mean? Like, That's, that's no knock against the game. I just, I'm running out of stuff to do. Having uh, larger overarching goals is really helpful. Um, but I've achieved most of what I want to achieve. And a lot of what I have left is not what I would consider, like, entertaining content. You know what I mean? Like, if I'm playing by myself, that's one thing. But if I'm sitting here streaming, just silent, <laughs> killing time, um, you know, like, going and, like, leveling up my skills and, like, trying to get my last couple of skills leveled up. It's like, to me, that's not, that's not interesting. I do need seaweed as well. Um, I need that for bait. So I can make uh, bait for fishing, actually, come to think of it. I do need, in fact, seaweed. So I'm gonna get, grab some of that one down here too. Yeah, I mean, considering how much time I've put into this game, dude, like, we, uh, doing alright. As I said, it wouldn't be what I consider that the end end of the series but it would, it would be a temporary <laughs> temporary hiatus um until you know cause like I get I'm not even at town rank A guys I'm not even at B so you gotta think about it from my perspective of like the amount of grinding I have to do to get town rank um even A is gonna be just horrendous so I don't think that's a journey I'd bring you guys along for. I said I might do some uh, 
off-screen stuff. To, uh... You know, kind of push us forward. So I might end up, uh... Playing some of this on my own time. To, uh... Progress... Progress forward, because I want to see what the tree planting festival uh, looks like, and I want you guys there for that one. So, I'll probably end up playing some of this during the week to um, fun popping. Uh, just kind of get time, press forward. And then, uh, yeah. Uh, the, unfortunately, the Stardew 1.6 is not on console yet. Right, I think I'm going to call that good enough. Let's go. We got to start refining all this osmium kelp. Um, so the one, Stardew 1.6 isn't out yet. And I want to, I want to wait until the 1.6 is out before we start playing that. So we might play, uh, I might find another cozy game we could play for a little while. Uh on the channel. So, that'd be cool. It'll be cool. Like I said, cozy, cozy Sundays will continue. Um, so it's not, uh, don't, don't, don't vary about, um, Everything. We're not gonna. It's not all gonna disappear. Oh, I already have. Oh, son of a bitch. Uh, well, never mind. I'm already a step out of myself. Let's head head back down there, and I'll go give it to her right away. Yeah, we kill some time. Take a little bit of time. Good, you're here. Let's see what you brought. Figured there was going to be a longer list of things I was going to need, but hey. Excellent. These are just right. There's a harmony in these ingredients. But, wait. There's something missing. Oh, of course, the riddle. In a dance of colors, it stands tall, neither plant nor creature, but a bit of both. It saps, its sap gives life and binds them all. Uh, an enemy? No, it's the coral tree. We need its sap. That's what I thought it was, but I wouldn't. Mm -hmm. Let's go, Lee. The coral tree awaits. By the powers of the sea and the balance of the tides, gift us your essence, O Coral Tree, to bridge land and ocean wide. Quickly, must hurry back to Toyo's chamber. Grace yourself, Lee. May the ocean welcome you with open arms. Yeah, there are some things I feel like I need to tell my wife about. Um. <laughs> there's. A oh! I'm a merman! I'm Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Yo! What the hell? I can have legs? Bro, what in the non hells is going on here? Aw, oh, sick, bro. Look at me. I'm a skull man. 
I got whale legs, bro. Sick. Sick. What on earth? What on earth is going on, bro? That's tiger shark. That's bull shark, ain't it? You don't kind of feel in the classic great white, my guy. I'm kind of feeling the classy great white kind of approach. I don't really like the creature from the Black Lagoon legs. I'm not really feeling that. I'd rather be like a full. You know, the orca pretty cool too. I ain't gonna lie. The orca pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with the, the great white. Yeah, it's sick. Why am I gonna zoom in on my face? That doesn't really seem to do much for me now. Ow! Do you like it? I have a tail? Yeah, you do. You make a fine merfolk, Lee. Who would have thought? Now go. The ocean beckons you to explore it in your new form. You're one of us now. Merfolk is one of the best embracing you are one of their own. Oh, joie, joie. All right. Does this mean I can like talk to people now? Am I allowed to like talk to folks? No. <laughs> I'm a fish man. Honey, you won't believe this shit. <laughs> I, got some, I got something to tell you. I just teleport back on a lane and just die. Just fish out of water. Just freaking perish. <laughs> oh no, my husband. He's become fish. Well, that's a fun development. And after you've pretty much already explored the entire ocean, you don't really have... I have much else to do there. There is the one ocean shop I might be able to... play around in. Um, anything here I wanted to double check my price on? Giggles and coos can be heard from within your home. Seems like a little munchkin is making an entrance. Hey, yo! Yo! Baby boy! That's what I'm talking about! Uh... Damn, what do I name the baby? Uh... Yo, <laughs> he's gonna be Humphrey. <laughs> you know, else just had a belty, <laughs> belty, healthy baby boy. I'm so happy right now. You, our child, our lovely home. I couldn't ask for more. We got a baby. I'm looking forward to New Year's festival. It's so fun. Yo, you never showed one sign of pregnancy. Hey, yo, you're not the baby anymore, Plumbus. Where's the baby, bro? I got a baby. Look at this shit. Hi, baby. You want some, uh, stuff? You want a watermelon? All in all, it's been a exciting stream for the simple fact that just so much weird shit has happened. Oh, uh, I don't know. Let's take some of the shit out. Here. Give me that. Give me that. We got nothing else to put in there. <laughs> it 
It is exciting. Nope, even though we're uh, nearing the end of the series, there's still, there's still fun to be had. There is still fun to be had. As I said, we've, we've I forgot that it was even there. Snake fruit? We've, uh... As I said, we've done just about everything fun, man. We've done... We're a merfolk now? Like... Can we... Can we what? It is snowing today, though, which means we do have, uh... We can go do some fishing and hopefully maybe scrounge up the last couple of fish for winter. Um, which should be fun and exciting. Like I said, man, we are, we're, we're cruising, man. This has been such a fun game, though. So enjoyable. Sound was just crapping out there for a second, but it's okay. Yeah, I mean, we're... Pfft. Oh, there's the greeny boy. Let's make some more green tea. Let's check out the greenhouse. Damn! So, I mean, we got a freaking greenhouse now that's cool that's pretty cool i don't really have anything i want to plant in there right now but uh you know that's all i sell both these snake roots <laughs> don't particularly uh care so yeah we can do some fishing let's do the fish forecast um the sheep head from over here uh, from the forest ocean so we got the forest ocean I think forest river is taken care of uh, well I got the arapaima I can go catch again uh, which is fine town river nothing there temple lake uh, I do have to catch another sturgeon to donate it puffer fish and then the yellow fin which has this the tiniest uh, window so beach ocean and dock ocean are the same uh there's a frog fish to be caught estuary how are we doing here just the frog fish again um pond okay what about the garden lane sturgeon again okay rice field anything here nope all right so my goal is to go over to the town dock ocean well we're gonna come over here uh because sheephead can be caught pretty much all day um, what I'm going to do, though, we are going to craft, um, I have no bugs. That's problematic. Good thing I have these, uh, traps down that allow me to yoink, 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 um, catch bugs. That's one reason I've left those ones there, is so I can, uh... They work for this. All right, so I got twelve bait, which I think I'm gonna save for trying to catch the yellow fin. And if I remember correctly, it was the forest, which is this way. Yep, which is over here. 
Uh, if you give me just one second, I'm going to go use the restroom. I've been holding it for too long. Oh, right. Cool. So, I guess we're gonna... Make a bunch of noises, I guess. Look! There's no shit here. Look how nice this is. Wow, somebody healed the ocean and got rid of all the roots. Oh, I gotta claim the quest reward there. Oh! Well, that was fortuitous. <laughs> okay. Whatever I'm reeling in, it ain't really putting up a fight. Firefish. Ooh, we got a fighter. If I catch another sheep head, that'd be pretty, uh... Nice, honestly. If I can catch me another sheep head, so I can take one to the shrine and then one to the museum. Another polka dot fish, I think. Or bat fish, sorry. Oh, mackerel. Uh, let's claim this. Quest real quick. But she give me more than just oh my gosh, I'm literally three points off. I need give me please give me another sheep head, bro. We get the town rank B. That'd be pretty sweet.
Another mackerel, come on. I caught one sheep head, bro. And the sheep head didn't even feel like it was that difficult to catch. It was actually pretty easy. So, could you give me another one? Please? That's not a mackerel. Why do I keep, like, getting stuff that's, like, harder to catch than, like, the one thing I need? So we're going to cast out one more time for another sheep head. And then I want to head to the docks on the other side to try and catch that yellowfin tuna. So it's such a tiny window to catch, by the way. Another firefish, okay. Ignoring all of that. Just ignoring it. put in some work I catch the elephant tuna. First thing I catch is the elephant tuna I need. That's hilarious, dude. Using bait. Bait is the equalizer. Bait really is the equalizer. It's hilarious. So if I can catch another fish that I need, it would be really cool. So I can go turn it into the museum. And I can bump my town rank up to B. Oh, you're not you're not putting up much of a fight. Just power through you, not flame back. Um I can cast out one more time to hopefully catch another yellow fin. If not, I'm going to go switch uh, fishing locations. Pink snapper. It's certainly a yellow fin. That's a double fish. That's pretty cool. Okay. So we're going to go change locations. Let's actually head back to the farm for just a moment. I don't know why. That was such a weird route to go. Um... I want to go check the computer uh, one more time. So, what about the estuary? I can get there's a frogfish in the estuary. What about lighthouse? I can do frogfish. No, it's nighttime, so there's only the frogfish. What about beach ocean? Anything nighttime related here? Oh, I can do beach ocean. I can do yellowfin. Two, oh no, oh uh, yeah, no, I'm stupid, so it's been noon to evening, okay. I could try going sturgeon fishing. Yes, because I, I want to go up to the temple anyways and drop these two fish off I have. So we're going to go sturgeon fishing. Nope. And that is saltwater fish done. That's also town rank B. Take reward. Small fish bait. Cool. Town rank B. We got the llama and the luwak now. We got new animals. So. Um, I'm not going to go sturgeon fishing now. Actually, that was a joke. And hitting my pop filter. 
we actually have uh, something more interesting to ponder now. We have something much more interesting to ponder. Um, small fish bait, I'm just going to toss in here for now. Reorganize that. We have new animals we can go get. So, we might, uh... We... Town rank B. I won't let me tech everything. New clothing, new decor. 600 merit points, and then my relationship with pretty much everybody goes up. I think my relationship with everybody goes up, because I've increased the town rank, so... Huge. Where's my wife? Uh. I can't even, like, interact with the baby. Oh, <laughs> uh, where, where'd my wife go? <laughs> That's concerning. Emma. This time of year, here's one of my favorite recipes. Here's a recipe to make tarts. For spring frittata. A little noodle joke there for you. If you like ramen, try this recipe. Seafood ramen. One of my favorites. Absolutely phenomenal. Winter fair. Holy shit. Uh... Yet again, I raised the question of, where the hell's my wife? <laughs> um. <laughs> Fuck me, Humphrey. <laughs> oh, he has no expressions, and he has no outfits. It's funny. Uh, oh, all right, that menu just kind of, uh, find NPC. All right, she got up early, apparently. Let's go, I want to go talk to my wife. It's kind of odd that she's, she wasn't in bed or next to me. She must have woke up earlier than me. It sounds really starting to feel like a, feel like the place Sookie and I grew up in. It's wonderful seeing it bounce back. I love when it's sunny outside. It feels great on my skin. As a person who is lacking in melanin, let me tell you what. The sun does in fact feel good for small periods of time. And coconut de mer. Here, I'm just gonna honk, whack that in there. Pears. Avocado and some lychee. Well, hopefully it's Tuesday. I believe the we can go pick up our new animals, which would be really cool. Already pet you. Jackie's happy. It's fucking awesome. Because, I mean, the two new animals gives me two more of the rare artisan goods. Or animal barn ranching, whatever the hell you want to call it, um, which is one step closer for the um, next town rank, I guess. Because it's all, you know, it's all one step at a time. It's, uh, unfortunately, to make progress one way, you have to kind of get everything else done. But we have made good progress. 
Let's go offload some more stuff, and then we're gonna head up there and hopefully. Um, get some new animals. Hello, I would like to purchase uh, more strange creatures. Shop. Animals. Llama. Adult llama lives in the barn. We'll produce llama wool when properly cared for. Four available spaces. Pick an old lady name again. I like the old lady names. Do I have a Greta? I don't know if I have a Greta. Uh, uh, you know, what you're just gonna be uh, Kimmy. No! Damn it, Lee, you hit the wrong button. And a Luwak. Although it lives in the barn, will produce... Produces Geshe coffee beans. You are gonna be... Uh... Burp. Dang it! I messed up naming my animals again. So I was gonna do Kimmy and Timmy. Plumus, it's getting, uh. What are you packed over here? Burp. Kimmy and Llama. Damn it. I got a pig named Pig. I got a frickin' Llama named Llama now. You can't, you can't change their names, bro. It's so annoying. <laughs> Uh, that's frustrating. Alright, well, we got a couple of llamas now. We got all sorts of fun new, fun new friends. I think we got all the birds. Those are the last two animals, I believe, you can acquire. Um, so that's pretty cool. As I said, another thing I want to do is I want to buy some stuff for the house. Um, let's do some, some online shopping. Um... We got some more indoor decor. Um, I want to buy some plants. Small tropical plants. There's a uh, art potted plants. Do you not just have any like tropical potted plants? It looks pretty nice. Classic potted plant. Conch vase. Baroque. Um, I want to replace my kitchen table, too. Is there, like, a nice kitchen table that I could, like, acquire for myself that's not, like, too much, I guess? Oh, there's so much stuff now. <laughs> I mean, I did level up the town, so I did add new stuff. Um, let's get a couple of extra potted plants. That'll make the house... That'll definitely help out. Um, kind of like the classic looks pretty good, but I also like the tropical. Let's get a couple of those. Modern wall decor. 
blue and black wall decor that's soundproof panels. Ooh, a gamer painting. Yeah, we got one of those for the house. Gamer rug. It's a these are funny. Mysterious goose bill. Ooh, ooh, we got a fancy Baroque wall mirror. Mermaid themed flooring. Blue fabric wardrobe. Gaming room wall. Ooh, we can get a medium aquarium now. Let's buy that. Um, yeah, yeah. I wish there was like a new fireplace though. I wish I can get like a fancier looking fireplace would be pretty cool. So we got the aquarium. This winter ski boots. Um, winter welcome rug. Yeah. Okay. Got the, the smell of vision. Which I literally never use. Um, <laughs> I really don't. I don't use the thing at all. Um, yeah, you know, I think we're I'm okay with that for now. As I said, there's really not... Not too much, I guess. Basic table. Gamer chair. Turn my whole house into a gamer. <laughs> Absolutely piss my wife off. Hun, I may have purchased some things. She's like, are you a moron? And I'm like, yeah, yes. Actually, you got me. All right, let's uh, you know, put some put some some plotted plants up in the corners, I guess. Yeah, I guess. Look at that. Nice. Um, a big fancy mirror up here? Sure. Uh, a, my bigger aquarium? Oh, first of all. Where, where's it? Gamer painting! Oh yeah, bro. Decorate. Um, where was uh how do I there we go. And then I can do most of the buttons put back. Really, you can. There's not much to decorate the house with. You can't really put fish in there, which kind of sucks. Um, I. How did. You know what? Just not gonna question it. Not gonna question it. Uh, yeah, we can, we can go look at the new clothing items, I guess. We'll do that. We'll check out all the, kind of, our B-Rank stuff. Um, but yeah, no, I think, uh, this will be the last, last day of this stream. And then, um, I think next week is probably gonna be it, guys. I think next week we will do our last stream. Um... Possibly, or this is this might be the last stream for uh, <laughs> Coral Island. I don't want to. 
just kind of ended off unceremoniously. You know what I mean? But some new hoodies. It's cool. Oh, muscles. Just some new sleeveless linen shirt. Ooh, slim jogger with chain. Boy, howdy. Oh! Bunny slippers, dude. Hell yeah. Green running shoes. Dude. Oh my god, I'm the ultimate hipster now. Oh, I have you. Oh my god. I look like a menace. I look like if I show up anywhere, people just gasp. And they're like, shit, he's here. <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, I mean, we're, there's, there's not much to do. Um. Uh, is it Art Nouveau is the new one? Oh no, there this this is the oh this is this is a piranha plant. Oh my god, I can do the whole farm and gaming tiles now. Mine I can bring Minecraft trees all over the farm. Oh my gosh. Bauhaus. Uh, let's look at indoor styles. This guy's Japanese, Art Nouveau, East Asian, Beach, Basic, Kosan, Baroque, and here's the Bauhaus style. Which I'm probably pronouncing wrong, but, uh, bite me. Gaming room style. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Neoclassic, then there's the spooky, the mermaid, the winter, the cabin. You're telling me there's a new... Okay. Cool. Yeah. That's, um... As I said, aside of the tree planting festival, guys, there's, like, nothing else to do currently. Like, I don't know... Um... Here, I'm gonna just check something over on uh, this other. Uh, if I can get crap out of my way while I'm trying to type here, that'd be really nice. Coral Island B rank. Um. Uh, let's see. The town rank affects stories, inventories, crops, and seeds. Uh, I want to see if new items at the blacksmith, carpenter, laboratory, Sam's general store. And unlocks llama and luwak at the ranch. New clothing and new decor. So that's it. Um, getting to A rank currently only gets you new clothing, new decor. And then friendship points with everybody. So I could go check a couple of the other stores. Um, see what sort of other stuff has popped up too. I mean, if they're uh, open and available. It says there's new stuff at the blacksmith. So we can go take a look over here. I have... Oh, God. What can I get you today, Miss Pufferfish? Karen is fine, Mr. Sanchez. I'm here to announce my candidacy for the upcoming mayoral election. Mayor election? We have that? I thought Mayor Connor is the mayor. He is, for now. But that's mostly because he's running unopposed. Right, right. We had a meeting a few years back when we said that Mayor Connor will still be mayor. So you want to be mayor of this small town? Why? I see the potential in this town, like you, for example. You and your brother are extremely talented blacksmiths. But I can't help but notice that all your tools are obsolete. There are machines out there that can make your production time much shorter. In turn, you'll have more fun to enjoy the small town life. I can do that. 
and more if you vote for me as mayor of Starlet Town. Why don't you read this pamphlet? I'm sure it will be of interest to you. I look forward to your vote in the upcoming election. Well, hello there, farmer. Don't worry. I'll talk to you soon. I want your vote, too. She's a real piece of work, I can tell you that much. What are you reading? Miss Pufferfish wants to be mayor. This is her pamphlet. But Mayor Connor is mayor. That's what I said. Do you know what this is all about, Lee? Huh. Well, let's see. Deal with that later. I'm gonna help you. Oh my god, I got another... Two in a row? We got a nice little place here, mate. Hey, you wanna play some pool? I'm heading to the tavern. Oh. TV show is about to start. Hmm. Yeah, it's okay. I'll miss one episode. Let's go. Hi guys. Hey Lee. We were just about to leave the leave to fish and sips. Come join us. Hey, nice to see you, bro. Um, wow, that's one sick shot. I was surprised myself. Let's see what you got, Yuri. Oh, now you're making me nervous. <laughs> so that's how I finally get you nervous, eh? Your pool ability. Ah, 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 ah. Nice. Woohoo! Come on, let's shoot some. Relieve Pablo. Relieve Pablo Rays. Whoa, the grand alias is mentioned. Show him, Pablo. Yo, not in front of my brother. I don't want him to say things to my folks, yo. <laughs> say what? I can't say anything if I wanted to. I don't know what you... We live Pablo Reyes. Fine, fine. Uh, I don't think these folks understand how pool works, but if y'all are having fun, that's that's okay. Yes! Pablo Reyes is back! Three rounds of Frank's special drink for everyone. Ha <laughs> ha ha, no thanks. A long cutscene, eh? Hey, yo, I heard that! Looks like pool game between me and Pablo is off. I think I'll go home. Oh, the TV show is still on. You're ready there, sis. Sending over some free beer for the winner. Challenge accepted. Right on. I just, I just... Guys, I just wanted to see what your new inventory was. What's up, Raphael? Oh, I can buy Osmium Orb now. Just straight buy Osmium. It's 4,500 uh, ore. So I'm imagining, because it says the general store. Oh, whoops, went the wrong way. Go check Sam's. I doubt Sam's is going to have anything for us either. Not really. Uh, not for winter, anyways. Um, and then I could probably just buy, like, buy Osmium Kelp and shit now. Okay. I doubt there's really. And eh, I'm just going to check. Because uh, I don't want to be wrong. 
Um, yeah, there's no new equipment. There's an empty thing here, but I don't think that's gonna be anything. Other than that, man, we don't really have uh, anything else to. So we'll go check out Sam's, but I doubt it being winter. I don't. We're gonna have much else to take a look at. Oh my God! Another cutscene. Hi, Eve. Eva. Hey there, you. Perfect timing. Should have known with all the friendships going up that there would have been a bunch of these events. Come and try this bread. Yummy, isn't it? It's so fluffy. Let's try this new rice for you. It makes the bread so much softer. Wow, this is the best bread I've ever had. Really? I'm not sure about that, but thank you. I appreciate the kind words. I think I'll mail a recipe to Bree tomorrow. She bakes her own bread, you know? She has to give this one a try. Well, why don't I mail it to you, too? You know what? I think I'll do that. You just give it to me right now. Since you're here, do you help me out real quick? My hands are full. Did you take the cookies out of the oven, please? I'd hate for them to burn. Uh, I see loaves of bread in your oven right now, but okay. Yeah, I didn't just burn myself. Oh my, you okay? What happened? Uh, I forgot to use an oven mitt. Oh no, I'm so sorry. You poor thing. Let me fix you up. I am wearing gloves, technically. Technically, I'm fine, but you yeah, know. Uh, um, sorry about what happened. Hope your hands heal soon. I'm a tough boy. Oh my god, another one. <laughs> Shit. Maybe you're right. I think it really was the blueberry cookies that were bad. Alright, guys. I hate to do this to everybody, but I'm just... I don't, I don't I don't care about those characters. I don't I I know I know everybody's probably screaming at me. What the hell? We got orange, we got durian, mango, peach, apple, olive. So we can see the new trees. What are their grow periods? Fall, fall, summer, summer, spring, 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 winter, spring. Uh spring. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, guys, I think that's uh, that's it for today. As I said, I'm I'm undecided on uh, whether or not we are gonna stream this again next week, or if we're gonna start some other cozy game next week. I'm really undecided um we don't really have anything else to do really um and i've kind of hit kind of hit a point where i feel uh pretty pretty satisfied with uh coral island you know what i mean like i feel i feel kind of satisfied and satiated um, at least kind of with this playthrough and where we're at right now, you know what I mean? There's really nothing much else aside of the tree planting festival, which I don't know if I want to dedicate an entire stream to that. You know what I mean? I don't know if that's something I want to set aside an entire stream for because my energy hasn't been the same. Um, now that we've kind of hit a point where everything's kind of quieting down, and we're hitting a point of, um, you know, I've basically done everything. And I'm not achievement hunting, so, like, I don't really want to just, like, sit around and do all that. So, that's, that's no fun to me, and I don't think that's particularly fun content, uh, to watch, 
me just sitting around, kind of farting around for hours <laughs> working on achievements. Because the achievements are, they're long-winded. They are incredibly, yeah, it's a festival running today. I mean, if we look at the achievements, um, I mean, earn like 10 million. Uh, all the artifact collection, gem collection, dinosaur collection, bug collection, fish collection, sea critter collection, complete the museum collection. 0.07% of people have gotten this achievement. Uh, restore the temple, 1% of people have done that. Reach five hearts with all NPCs, less than 1%. Uh, reach eight hearts with everybody, 0.01% have gotten that. Give 25 NPCs, give a gift to all NPCs. That one's actually not hard, you just have to give a gift to everybody. Have two children. You don't even get an achievement for having one. One is nothing to, in this game. They're like, nah, you gotta have two. Cook 15 recipes. Cook all recipes. 0.06%. Craft all things. 0.01. Purchase 50 clothing items. Purchase all clothing items. Ship all animal products. Ship everything in the game. Uh, and they don't track, so you, I don't know how deep I am into this. Ship one animal product 1,000 times. Reach uh, level 10 mastery in everything. So, we're not going to achievement hunt. Um... So I will keep you guys posted on if we are going to continue with Coral Island or if I might just play a little bit of it myself to see what sort of the last little bit is. Because um, I just... It's another stream or two to get to where I want to get. It's just like, oh my gosh. Um, but that's okay. That's okay. We've had so much fun. And, uh, you know, we'll have fun with whatever we play next. Um and that's cool too. But I appreciate y'all. Make sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. We're always having fun. There's always something new to do. And that's okay. I don't know why I grabbed my controller. I had to move it out of my way. But I appreciate y'all so much. And uh, upwards and onwards. There's always more stuff to play. As I said, I have a ton, a ton of stuff planned uh, for the channel. Tons of tons of new stuff dude we're gonna be we're gonna be having so much fun we're rolling into a lot of new stuff and it'll be great so i appreciate y'all and i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and hope you guys have a good week ahead of you i'm hoping i have a good week ahead of me uh yeah take it easy everyone catch you later peace